All oh, those answers oh, are please, available I know where you're to going. us one year ago. They are available today. Oh, they please. are available today. Fuel price hike, fertilizer hike, LPG cap. How much have you all made with this LPG cap? We asked the uh, finance minister <laughs> in parliament. How much have you saved with the LPG cap? Tell us the number. 1000 crores. So LPG cap, fuel price hike, fertilizer hike, price rise. These on these issues we walked out of government really? 12 months ago. Really? If you had listened to us at really? that time, Edwin, you wouldn't Edwin, have been. Really? That's situation. rubbish. That's complete rubbish, Derek O'Brien. Because when Rahul Gandhi was meeting the Prime Minister on price rise right. in December 2000, 2009, you were part of the government. When inflation was at an high in 2010, you were part of the government. I'm when scams, when scams ago. hit the government, oh, no. when scams hit the government, and inflation one was going high, you were part of the government. Ago. You were defending the Ek government Sala. against scams. So, oh my, oh my God, Mr. Derek O'Brien, don't turn it around like that. Don't make it out to be like Tirnamool walked out and prices went. Nobody's going to believe ago. you on that one. One year ago. Nobody's going to believe you on that one. one I won't ago. believe you on that one. Derek O'Brien, well I tried. Could I well tried, Mr. Brian. Randeep Surjewala responding. Randeep Surjewala, after that, make that this side. Anup, two things uh, are my learned friend from the BJP raised. He said that there is no need for states. States have no responsibility to control price rise or to control inflation in any manner. May I, may I respectfully ask him? Where are the onions grown if not in states? They are not, they are not grown in the backyard of Delhi. So that's why I said center or state, they are BJP rotting in or Mumbai Congress Port. or any other regional they are rotting party. In Mumbai Port. We are joint stakeholders. They are rotting and in Mumbai if there Port. is holding in Madhya. Sir, they I did not interrupt in you. Port. You will have to hear me, sir. You cannot interrupt they are me rotting. in this fashion. They are rotting and in if, Mumbai if Port. there is holding in Madhya Pradesh, Let me tell you if where there they is are. holding in Chhattisgarh, where they currently the onions are, is it not the responsibility of Mr. Chauhan and Mr. Raman Singh to be a party, to participate along with the... One second, BJP is not doing Inflation. I deny your entire allegations with the content it deserves. And sir, and sir, may I also point out to you, may I also point out to you, the inflation during NDA rule was, was at a peak and, and th I think Arnab Goswami just pointed out to you when you were raising the issue that you lost power. Congress? Whether it is urban area or, or I said lost part in Delhi. Up, I want to tell your viewers with all humility at my command, we are seized of the situation and we are completely aware of. Why you have been? No, no. What is? What do you mean by seized? Of, sorry, no, no. Sorry, but what's, what's, I have one question. No, no. What is the view? What is on the viewer's mind tonight? Right? The viewer is asking you, Mr. Surjewala, thank you, you are seized of the situation. Back in August 2010, a person called Manmohan Singh was also seized of the situation when he conceded, and I quote, it is the poor who are worst affected by rising prices, especially pulses and vegetables. Since you were seized of the situation in 2010, and since seven months before the elections, you are a self-proclaimed uh, champion of the poor, how does it help me if you are seized of the situation and do nothing? You have been seized of the situation for the last Anab, four years. Anab, with due regards, Congress has taken proactive steps. What? And why do we why do we watch the whole debate on food security bill with contempt? You just said you just take, said you are taking poor, steps to urban middle class, Make to rural poor, to rural middle class. Eighty-two <laughs> crore people out of hundred and twenty-one crore people within its net. What? Why are we watch? Why are we looking at MP what? Narega you, with contempt? Is, is, the, is, the, is, the, is, is this, the is the is the is this food security person. bill? Is Arnab, this even is, you and me can go and get a job card made? Is this food security bill your only lifeline? Right to the no, poor farmer. And, is food food security bill is your only lifeline. Meghna Desai is responding. Meghna Desai, every question I ask to the esteemed I, Congress spokesperson, I find that he goes back to the food security bill. The food security bill, Mr. Surjewala says, there's a key point. Meghna Desai, your rebut to the Congress. You know, it's obvious that for the last four and a half years, Congress has been <coughs> unable to control inflation. Since these people are clever, we ask ourselves, do they actually not want to have it this way? Maybe Rahul Gandhi is really saying, with inflation, we will create more poor people, and then those poor people will support me. That is how I'm a champion of the poor. Oh, again. Inflation will create more poverty, and I'm a champion. Is that Maybe a theoretical? That's, that's a secret Congress program well, well, BJP... of creating more poverty so they can get elected. Well, I think that's that's one big grand Meghnath Desai conspiracy. I give I give the last word tonight to Derek O'Brien. <laughs> Derek... Can I make well, one well, point? Well, Vinod Mehta, not... actually. Vinod Mehta. Go ahead, Vinod Mehta. Adnab, I am sorry. 
that this demonization of the food security bill <laughs> I was expecting is that. a separate issue. I think, can I just say that price rise and food security bill are completely different things. And this, Mr. Surjewala's defense of states holding or Mr. Derek O'Brien saying that if uh, Mamta Banerjee had been in the UPA, this would not have happened. The fact of the matter is, this is it completely cannot be justified on any ground. These kind of prices no, what is, what cannot is, be no, justified. Can I on ask any a straight ground? question? What about Mr. And Sharad if, Pawar? Uh, uh, no, what about Mr. Sharad Pawar when he was well, when, he, when sugar prices go up? Well, I, that I brought that up. That See, Mr. Sharad Pawar is a disastrous food minister, agriculture and food minister. He's a disaster. He's he's got his own agenda. What agenda? So what I'm saying is, Arnab, but let me say something. Well, and, and, and Arnab, the NCP's say. agenda, his own kind of interest in why does he want to export onions? I mean, we don't want to go into all that. But price rise, Anna. Uh, if anybody knows the if anybody knows the Congress knows, it will hurt them in the gut. I mean, I'm surprised that the Congress doesn't know this. The Congress is the one party who should know this. And I'm surprised that they are so complacent on this and looking for all kinds of ridiculous excuses. Will you end this complacency, Mr. Surjewala, or will it take a little bit more media bashing for the co Congress party to realize here that it cannot expect the food security bill lifeline for people to excuse you on what's happening on prices? People are furious, Mr. Surjewala. It's just that you are in denial. Viewers. People are furious, oh, no. and you're in denial. Yes, Su Mr. Surjewala. Lastly, one minute on the not. debate. I just want to tell your viewers that government of India and the food minister, Mr. Thomas, has already fixed the export price at seven hundred dollars per ton, while the international prices are four hundred. So that there is no outflow, there is only inflow, and we have proceeded to import nine lakh tons. It is arriving today as we speak and hold this discussion. And I want to assure your, your, your viewers inefficient and I want food to assure minister. everybody no, your, your is watching your channel your that one oh, week no. and things will be under control. No, why it's why one week? Phenomenon that why why one week? I have figures. Also I have figures. No, no, every time you buy time. No, why one week? Whichever is the color of your government, everybody must help and cooperate government of India into ensuring that the food price inflation oh, goes no. down. Derek O'Brien, government's asking for time. Last word will be to Ravi Shankar Prasad. I don't think, by the way, I just want to say one thing. I'll if your food you, minister did not know that 60% of the poor households spend 60% of their income on food, right? More than an average household. So if Rahul Gandhi is a champion of the poor, he should first get that statistic right. Yes, Derek O'Brien. <clears throat> See, firstly, Arnab, send, send your cameras to the port in Mumbai. There are hundreds and tons of onions which are rotting there. So is that a conspiracy? We are concerned about, we are concerned about the API, the Al Alu Piaz index. Well, for the Congress party, that starts in Khan market in Delhi. So they need to get out of this Khan market Biting in sarcasm. Delhi because the reality on the ground is different. No. What does Khan market know? I now we want, being, we being want the prices to come down. Members. What the minister is saying, what the minister has said one yeah. month ago, the spokesperson has said today, but nothing will change. Nothing will change. This government has to go. Last Things word to Ravi Shankar Prasad. That. Last word to Ravi Shankar. Now that you've got your internal issues corrected, what's the BJP going to do? Uh, Arna Goswami, if the, this government led by an economist, Prime Minister Dr. Manmohan Singh, ably guided by Sonia Ji and Rahul Gandhi, could not control price rise for four and a half years. Will they able to do any miracle in the coming six months? With the time of their impending departure? The reason as to why we are suffering is gross mismanagement of food economy. The left hand does not know what the right hand is doing. The PM does not have any authority. Ministers are having a field run. And <coughs> all this has contributed to this situation, which has no reference to any global factor, which they keep on always saying. Well, gentlemen, Therefore, the issue is up is there. Nothing but a gross scale, gross mismanagement of food economy. The issue and the is sooner the term of this government ends, only then the Mr. redemption S will be Only be because Mr. Country. Surjewala has been one against four. Only and because and Mr. Surjewala has been one against four. I give him the last word. I just one line. 
Although the jury is out there and people of India will decide who will be, who will come back to power, I want to tell Shri Ravi Shankar Prashad and your viewers that agriculture output for the first time for last few years is growing at about 3.89 percent. Sir, it was less than 1 percent during the right. entire tenure of NDA. It is, it is the is UPA government it. that has brought sunshine to the entire agriculture sector. 240 million is the output of your vegetables and your fruits. I think what we need to do is preserve and protect it. And FDI in retail, to which you continue to oppose, sir, selectively, is one such answer. We need to build more cold chain, we need to protect farmer, and we need to make sure that farm to plate, when I, when that I ask, journey is quickened as far as possible. When I, when I ask a complicated question, sometimes I get no reply. When I ask a simple question sometime, then Randeep Singh Surjewala gives me a very complicated reply. Life is strange, it isn't Mr. Surjewala. Mr. Surjewala, today original line on the news are, is Derek O'Brien saying that the Congress party has a Khan market view of the world. Now, you know what you need to do. You need to rebut that, get the prices down. Thank you very much. I give the original line award on the debate to Derek O'Brien tonight. Thank you, gentlemen, for joining me.